The attack was the first of its kind in nearly 20 years and got immediate and worldwide attention. But two months have passed before I arrive and I fear that vital clues may have evaporated. I've enlisted the help of a United Nations ape expert and biologist, Ian Redmond, who's been following the mountain gorillas all his professional life. Here in Rwanda, because people don't eat gorillas, um, actually going out to kill a gorilla is a, a rare thing. And since the end of the 1970s, early 1980s, when the gorilla tourism began, uh, really gorilla poaching to capture babies uh, or to cut off their hands and head to sell to tourists, that, that became a thing of the past, which is why this latest incident was so shocking. Why is it so important that we follow up BBC's death? Well, hang on, we, we don't know that BBC is dead yet. BBC is missing. It, it may be that BBC is dead, but let's not presume that until we know.